Hey darling, just coming to you because I just want to give you guys um, just a quick update with my hair heat damage. Um, please don't mind me. I'm in the car and I'm about to go to the gym. Yes, sir. And I survived Hurricane Sandy, so thank goodness I'm in Philly. So only we only seen like a couple, well, I seen a couple of trees knocked down, but it wasn't that bad. But anyway, I just wanted to talk about what I did, and I'm probably going to do a video on that. Basically, I took some my Joico or just whatever conditioner you have, and I added an egg until I can get some more organic hair mayo, because that's usually what I use, and I add an egg to it when my hair is severely damaged. Not particularly for heat damage, just, you know, damage in particular. I mix it together, and I put it on my hair. I left it in overnight, and I can immediately see a difference. Um... Which is what protein treatments do because our hair is protein, so you know I wasn't shocked about that. But it's just, will it <laughs> help my heat damage? Will it mend it? I don't know the answer to that yet. Um, if it doesn't, I'm going to have to cut it off. Please excuse Dora. That's my daughter's car seat. Yeah, she upgraded. Mm. She talked me into it. That one was like a hundred and like twenty dollars. What was I thinking? anyway but basically what I might do is continue to do the protein treatments and continue to grow my hair out and I'm thinking about getting some MSM powder um, to add to my um, supplementation I'm juicing so that's another thing but I will add the MSM powder to my juicing and I seen a couple people on YouTube who just use the MSM powder along with their regular multivitamins and it makes their hair grow just as long if not longer than hair affinity because I need to find another alternative you know I love hair affinity I just want to see if the MSM works um, before I go and buy the hair affinity because the MSM is not just for hair growing it's other body things that help foot the body too and the powder is it goes straight into the bloodstream because I'm going to be adding to my juicing because I have been juicing so I'll let you I'll give you guys an update on that I'm probably going to go get the MSM as soon as I leave the gym so basically I'm just going to trim until you know when my hair grows out I might just trim pieces and pieces off or whatever I mean it's I mean I cut my hair before but this time it's like no I paid for this growth <laughs> I paid like a hundred dollars cuz I got them hair cut this growth off so that's why I'm just thinking about getting the MSM because if we have another mishap like this which I pray that we don't I'm gonna be highly upset $84 $100 no so this growth is gonna be $14.99 MSM powder <laughs> so oh my goodness but anyway also I'm trying to juice him I watched I didn't watch the whole thing but I just seen a couple things on YouTube um, fat sick and early dead the documentary and I always had a juicer, and I finally got it back from Maryland. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to juice. So I did yesterday. I placed, I was going to do the whole day, but I couldn't do that. So I had to work that in eventually. So what I did was I made two juice things of juice for breakfast and lunch, and then I ate dinner. And if you follow me on Instagram, what is it? Black Hair and Skin Care dot D-O-T com then you will see like I post pictures and stuff on there but I'm going to be juicing again today and I know yesterday I was 169.2 and this morning when I woke up I was 167.4 so even just replacing those two meals I lost like 1.6 pounds cute so I was like oh I'm about to go to that gym then <laughs> but anyway let me stop rambling but just giving you guys a quick update and I'll let you know what's going on with that here. Heat damage as far as the weight loss, MSM power and everything like that. Stay cute. Have a blessed day.